It's now time to feature those three little words that men find so hard to say. I don't know! <laughs> okay. Now, and to join my Uncle Red on the expert portion of the program is his best friend in the whole wide room, Mr. Hap Shaughnessy. <laughs> Is it true that basketball was invented by a Canadian? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's definitely true. Basketball was invented by a Canadian, but he was living in the United States at the time. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I was in the States. <laughs> uh, but I didn't give up my Canadian citizenship. No, I was down there doing some hush-hush work for the CIA, as was then known as Teddy's Rough Riders. <laughs> They wanted me to come up with some sort of cover story as to what I did for a living, and I said, sports inventor. <laughs> and to make, uh, to, make, to make the cover a bit more uh, convincing, of course, mm -hmm. wouldn't you know, yeah. I had to invent a sport. <laughs> I sure didn't expect that darn game to catch on. Uh, you don't expect us to believe that, do you? Well... Huh? <laughs> you got me there, Rich. No, 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 that wasn't true. No, I, yeah. I sure did expect that darn game to catch on. <laughs> Mr. Shaughnessy, out of all the history books I've ever read, all of them, they say the Canadian was Mr. James Naismith. James Naismith, yeah, that was my CIA cover name. <laughs> Funny you never mentioned that, Hap. You know, it's not like you to hold back. Well, I know, Red, but uh, all my spy work was top secret, you know. The only reason I can mention this now is because Franco is dead. <laughs> and, 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 and Spain is no longer a threat to world peace. I'm finding this very hard to believe. That's because you're listening. <laughs> I'm telling you, I invented basketball. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hoop dreams. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Maybe, maybe Hap's right. Remember that time he was up on the drunk and disorderly, huh? Dribbling all over the court. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Red Green here. If you've ever wanted to see me live, or see if I still was alive, I'm doing a brand new one-man show, and this could be it. In fact, I'm calling the tour. This could be it. I'll be doing a U.S. tour in the spring and Canada in the fall. It's a 90-minute family-friendly live lodge meeting. To find out where I'm going to be and when I'm going to be there, go to redgreen.com and follow the links. Hopefully, I will see you on the road. Meanwhile, keep your stick on the ice.